The Dave Clark story is one of the most inspirational underdog stories you've probably never heard about. He's a baseball team owner, manager, and player. The odds of anyone doing all three are tremendous. But then again, Dave Clark has beaten the odds all through his life. At 10 months, Dave Clark was diagnosed with polio. And after spending a year at the Ithaca, New York Reconstruction Clinic, Dave Clark walked out using leg braces and crutches. What Dave Clark would do next would defy everyone's expectations. After perfecting the knuckleball and maintaining a rigorous training schedule, Dave proved to his teammates that he was not there on the team because of his crutches or a soft-hearted coach. He was there to play, and that's just what he did. Uh, when I was seven, I started playing. And it was a way of being accepted by my peers. And um, they, it was a way of getting out of the stereotype of being handicapped or whatever you want to call it. Dave proved himself as a professional pitcher in 1975 with the Indianapolis Clowns, America's last barnstorming baseball team where he was awarded the Fireman of the Year Award with a perfect record of four wins, no losses, and 20 saves. During this season, Dave caught the attention of Chicago White Sox owner Bill Veck, making Dave a legitimate major league prospect. Well, in 75, I had a good year. It was probably my best year in pro ball. I had a 4-0 record and 20 saves and a good earned run average, but the next year wasn't so good, so we won't talk about that. <laughs> You're building that uh, year. <laughs> Dave continued to participate in professional baseball as a coach, scout, manager, pitching instructor, and playing a behind-the-scenes role with the USA baseball team during the 1996 Summer Olympics in Atlanta, Georgia. Dave Clark is currently a motivational speaker, production consultant for Crutches to Champions, a movie of his own life story, and he continues to inspire organizing disability dream-induced sports camps with professional teams.